Hi guys, this is Tara with Gaia Tarot 13, and this is your weekly tarot card forecast for March 19th through March 25th, 2017. As always, with the tarot cards, I'm going to pull three cards, one for your work and financial life, one for your love and romantic life, and one for your home and family life. And let's get those. Okay. In your work and financial life, we have the Ten of Pentacles upright. And this is something working out in your favor. It's going to be a big payoff. Whatever you've been trying to accomplish, you're going to like see the fruits of that labor this week. Um, it could be a financial payoff. Of course, it is pentacles, so it could be something actually about money. Um, but it could just be, you know, about your career, like... Um, if you've been trying to get into school and you didn't think that you were going to get accepted into a certain school, this is maybe getting like a letter saying that you are accepted. I don't know what time of year schools send those acceptance letters or how that works out. Um, but this is kind of like you getting that surprise that it's working out in your favor when maybe you thought that it wasn't going to, you thought like an opportunity had already passed. Um, this is showing that you are actually going to be successful in whatever it is that venture that you are trying to accomplish. In your love life we have the lovers reversed. Okay, so this is about maybe taking some space, taking some time for yourself. This doesn't mean like it doesn't have to mean something like major big breakups or anything like that. Um, it just may mean that maybe you and your partner are getting too much in each other's space. You know, if you live together, if you're married, it's very easy to kind of just feel like you are on top of each other or attached at the hip or just together like all the time. <laughs> and this is kind of like remembering that you are two whole people with independent lives who are, you know, integrating your individual lives and creating a shared life, not that you're like one person. <laughs> so take back um, some time this week for yourself. It doesn't even have to be like, you know, I often say like rest and rejuvenate, do things that charge your batteries. Like it doesn't even have to be something like that. It's like go out with your friends, you know, do a hobby that you do only by yourself. If you want to watch like a certain kind of movie, like a chick flick, okay, so you want to go out to like a movie that your partner doesn't want to see, just go by yourself. Like it doesn't mean that you can't go to it. Um, so just taking some time to yourself to kind of like just spend time alone and rediscover who you are as a person so you don't lose yourself and lose your independence and lose yourself and your partner. Um, if you're single, you may find that you encounter someone this week who wants to take too much of your time. Um, it could be a friend or a business partner or something like that. Um, but you may find that someone is kind of trying to take a lot of your time and you may just be like, get out of my chili. Like, just give me some time alone. So just try and take some time by yourself this week. In your home and family life, we have the chariot upright. And this is saying whatever it is that you are trying to accomplish in your home life, in your family life, if you're trying to get pregnant, um, that's what's coming to me right now. Like if you're trying to get pregnant, you are going to be victorious. This is something working out in your favor. This is you um, accomplishing that task, completing that project, um, signing the contract for that house, whatever it is that you are trying to do, um, you're going to be successful with it. It's going to work out in your favor, which actually ties a lot to this too. So maybe if you're looking to like relocate for a job, if some of you are looking to relocate for a job, um, you may get the information that that's going to work out in your favor. And then you find the apartment in the new place, you know, um, something along that lines. But these are all really good cards. And this looks like I mean, it's a strong week. It's a week of things like going your way, essentially. So, um, and even this, like, isn't really that negative. It's just saying, you know, take some new time. So enjoy the time that you have to yourself. Do fun things that you enjoy doing. And know that everything else is kind of like being handled. Like, stuff's 
favoring you, like the universe is favoring you and it's going your way this week. So wonderful, beautiful. That's what we've got this week. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my YouTube page. If you want to get a personal reading with me, the only way to do so is through my website, which is GaiaTarot13.com. Be sure to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Tumblr, where I pull a tarot card every day, reading the energy of that specific day. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.